Uh, you're welcome, uh, colleagues. We want to give uh, an update on uh, our continued counter-terror operations uh, that are ongoing in the country. And uh, today we want to inform you that uh, our flying squad unit and crime intelligence tactical squads have managed to dismantle another terror cell in Nyendo Massacre where a cell leader was arrested and also several exhibits recovered. Uh, this is the third successful counter-terror operation uh, that has been uh, handled in the last uh, couple of weeks following the raids that we conducted on the terror cells in Maganjo and uh, Matuka. So far three suspected ADF suspects have been uh, arrested in these uh, uh, counter-terror operations. Uh, two were killed in a counter-strike operation in Matuga and an assortment of exhibits recovered then. Uh, we are happy that the leader of the terror cell in Nyendo Masaka, identified as Katende Ali, alias Mao, was arrested and uh, uh, what they were basically doing is that uh, they would do coordinate all these other attacks uh, from Masaka. They would join the other two terror cells in Maganjo and Matuga and uh, carry out attacks on uh, police stations units and uh, civilians in the country. So we built on the intelligence that we obtained from the earlier ADF suspects arrested and we managed to track down Katende Ali, alias Mao, a senior ADF commander of the Nyendo cell in Masaka. It was a major cell because uh, uh, we managed uh, to recover the PK machine, machine, the PK gun or LMG which was used in the attack at Usika, uh, in the attack at Chabadaza uh, police station. We also managed to recover seven SMGs and one pistol and an assortment of explosives uh, from the hideout in the populated neighborhood in Charugo village, Mugambira Parish, near the Mukungwe division in Masaka uh, city. So uh, from the uh, ballistic examination that has been carried out, uh, from uh, our forensics directorate. These uh, uh, ADF suspects have so far been linked to the attack at Rusika police station, which happened on the 31st of October, where three police officers, Detective Inspector Bagaluka Alex, Police Constable Mol Moses, and Police Constable Odama Steven were killed in the line of duty. The team also established that uh, this is the ADF group that was linked to their attack and murder of two civilians in Kasule Ayangua village, uh, who included Kaliango Ibra and uh, Sevuka Peter. The third one was injured and uh, eventually carried out to uh, an attack on Chabadaza police station where they rescued two of their colleagues and also burnt one of the officers. Uh, we have uh, obtained uh, information on the identities and descriptions of the other ADF remnants who are still at large and we are trying, we are going to aggressively pursue them and prevent them from their efforts of reconstituting and establishing operational cells in Wakiso district and Masaka city. We want to thank the residents in Nyendo who supported our intelligence and we urge all Ugandans to emulate them and reject all forms of terrorism because it totally undermines the values of liberty, humanity and freedom uh, in our country. We want to reassure all Ugandans that uh, we continue to prevent disrupt and dismantle terror cells and activities of hostile groups with violent ideologies in our country. The IGP has once again come out to thank 
the Flying Squad Unit and CI Tactical Squads for their bravery uh, in countering uh, these violent uh, uh, terrorists. And uh, uh, we also want to reiterate that uh, all the people whom we are arresting are not targeted for their beliefs or religion, but due to their acts of conspiracy and hostile engagements of violence perpetrated against Ugandans. Uh, we continue to we believe that uh, this arrest is going to create some more peace and sanity uh, in our communities. Merry Christmas to all Ugandans.